For the past five years, an estimated 600 new chemicals a year have been introduced into U.S. commerce. These chemicals have been sold without any systematic advance assessment of their potential impact on human health. As we have learned through our experience with materials such as vinyl chloride, polychlorinated biphenyls, asbestos, nitrosamines, and several others, we often do not discover how harmful a compound can be until it has become a commonplace item in our everyday life, even a significant factor in our economy. And again and again, we find ourselves engaged in an extremely difficult and drawn-out struggle to protect the public from a hazard to which it has already been exposed, while at the same time trying to avoid putting people out of work uh, or out of business. What is needed to cope with problems of this type, and you've heard me say this before, is a law which would authorize EPA to require pre-market testing of chemicals and also to limit uses and distribution of those which are found to pose environmental or health risks. Toxic Substances Control Legislation, now being written in both houses of Congress, would give EPA such authority. This urgently needed law would prevent dangerous chemicals from coming into widespread use in the first place.